Hey, my water sign friends, and thank you for joining me on my channel. This is for Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It's your love outlook for Sunday, August 12, 2018. Let's get started right away. Spirit and angels, what messages do you have for our water signs in love for Sunday? Sorry about the camera shaking. Okay, your guys' overall energy for Sunday is the Page of Cups in reverse, being clarified by the Ace of Swords in reverse. So somebody's not coming forward and um, being truthful about their feelings, about their love, um, because they're very confused right now. They don't know what to believe. They don't know what's real. They don't know if their feelings are real. They're just confused. So they're holding off coming forward and offering you love because they're not sure um, if for A, you want them. To come forward and be if what they feel is real. So we got <clears throat> Cancer, the Four of Swords in reverse, Pisces, whoa, the Sun, beautiful, you needed that. You guys have had some rough readings lately. And Scorpio has the Empress, beautiful energy um, for all of you, really amazing. Okay, so. Um, Cancer with the four swords in the reverse. You guys have um, you guys have really um, tried to look at all um, perspectives of the situation, and you just you you're not rushing into anything because of the hurt that you felt in the past. This person could have also um, betrayed you in the past, and you're not sure if you can trust them again with the Ace of Swords in the reverse. So you're taking your time, really hard to sit and think about it to see if this is something you want. Okay. For our cancer males, you have the wheel of fortune. This is what you should be doing. You are being drawn to do this. Um, you can trust this. This is on the upright, so good things are coming your way. Follow your heart. Uh, yeah, cancer females, you guys are getting over heartache. Like I was saying, this person may have betrayed you in the past, and now you're not sure if you can trust them. You are getting over heartbreak. You went from the three to the four. Beautiful energy. Um, trust your instinct. Trust your gut on this one is what I'm hearing. All right, Pisces males. Pisces males, thank you. You have the Seven of Pentacles. So you're being uh, a little impatient. Uh, you know that you're being guided in this direction. You know that this is what you're supposed to do. You're out doing, doing it because it's what you want to do. But you need to remain patient. You need to keep working on yourself. Um, keep doing the work uh, that you have to do because you're not quite there yet. Once you're there, it'll be in the upright. Just remain patient. Keep keep weeding your own garden is what I'm hearing. Um, Pisces females, you have the king of cups in reverse. So this person that you're dealing with, that you're meant to be with, this could definitely be a twin flame relationship because you're emotionally drained. And this person doesn't know what to do. They don't know whether to offer you their love. They're very confused because they don't understand the twin flame journey yet. Um, they will get there. They will awaken and it will be okay. So just please remember the sun is always there to guide you. Um, the sun is the male or masculine energy of the uh, twin flame relationship. The moon is the female energy um, of the relationship. So just remember your sun is coming. They are coming toward you, the masculine energy. Um, they do have a lot of love for you. They're just confused at the moment. Scorpio, you guys have an empress, the birth of something new, um, standing up for yourself, taking your power back is what I'm hearing. Um, you're very confused about who to offer your love with. Uh, Scorpios, you could be dealing with a Sagittarius female uh, that is just um, out of their vibration. They are not vibrating at their highest level. There could be, um, you could be wanting to start something with them and they're just not there yet. Uh, keep the faith because uh, something new is going to come out of this. And this person is very loving, nurturing, very sexy, very, um, you're very attracted to them. It will come to you. You just have to be patient as well. Scorpio females, you're all up in your head space. You're um, depressed. You're anxious. You're scared um, of being hurt. But uh, this Empress energy, that is you. So just be strong, be confident, and know that this person is going to come forward, this page of cups in reverse, they're going to come forward and offer you a relationship. So stop stressing about it. Um, they're just confused right now. But uh, that doesn't mean that 
um, that you, that it's not coming for you. Okay. Uh, Cancer, you guys have, keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type. So um, just make sure that you are open to a relationship with somebody other than who you expect it to be because this person you know, um, but they're not who you think it is. The person that you think that you're supposed to spend the rest of your life with, that's not it. Your soulmate is going to come in crashing into your world and it's going to take you by storm and it's going to be amazing. Um, Pisces, you guys have love yourself first. So self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Um, just make sure that you're doing your positive affirmations because, uh, the sun is here to guide you. Have no fear. The universe has your back and you are going in the right direction. Scorpio, for some of you, you are dealing with unrequited love. Um, Scorpio females, that is the reason for the nine of swords. Uh, there's relationships ending and that's for this group of you. And that's why they're not coming forward with this cup. They're very confused. Um, they, they're not sure if they love you. They're not sure if they want to be there. Um, so if you feel that there's a, a lack there that they're not, that you are not, cause I see that's on your side. Um, you don't have to be with somebody. Um, so if you feel that you're not attracted to them. Um, don't drag it out. Just end it because I see that being on your, uh, your side, Scorpio females. And that's why you're stressed out. That's why you're depressed. That's why you're losing sleep because you don't know how to end this relationship with them, but just be honest and let them know how you truly feel and let them go. Um, it may hurt. It may be hard, but in the end, it's only fair to them and yourself. So, I hope you guys have a beautiful Sunday and I will see you next time. Love, light, and God bless.